how to make a paracord bracelet without the buckles with the four strand diamond stop knot in the box trail knot paracord tutorial enjoy and have fun hello my friends welcome back to the alpha 1982 youtube paracord community i hope that you're all well safe and sound and that you're ready for yet another awesome paracord project the inspiration for this project came from why not paracord and today we're gonna use the green and the gold paracord 550 if you want to learn how to make this beautiful paracord bracelet i'm wearing today the full tutorial you have in the top right corner information cards also down below in the description of this video so first we're gonna take the green paracord and we're gonna pull it by the end so we'll find the center of our cord so like this and we're gonna do the same with the gold one take the ends find the center and now from here I'm gonna zoom a bit so you can clearly see okay we're gonna cross the green paracord like this and we're gonna create the cow's hitches with the gold so we're gonna take this bite and enter into the loop of the green or a green loop and then we're gonna pull the ends from the top into this loop of the gold paracord. And now we're gonna lock our loop. We're gonna take the green paracord, make it on top of the gold paracord, and then around and to the back, like so so through the middle and from the back we're gonna pass it from the top into this loop so take the end of a cord and from the top pass it through the loop pull this end to tie the strand and by doing so as you will see we locked our loop so it cannot be um, adjust to be bigger or smaller so it will stay as we created so we're gonna take the left strand and we're gonna do the same in the middle around and from the back side we're gonna pass it from the top into the loop and we're gonna tie it And now we have the secured loop and the four working ends and we're gonna start with our today's project weaves we're gonna take the gold right side or right a right side strand make it on top of the left side strand like this and then make it around and create a little bite like so and again under the left strand as you can clearly see now from here we're gonna take the left strand make it around to the back and then we're gonna pass it from the back through this loop here or a gap as you wish and from here we're gonna pass it from the top into the loop and we're gonna tie this not here So from here we're gonna do the same as we did before on the starting of our weave. We're gonna take the green, make it on top of the gold, around and then from the back side we're gonna pass it through the loop from the top and we're gonna secure our nuts and working ends.
around and from the back through the loop. So one more time, we're gonna take our gold paracord, make it on top of the left strand core and then around and now from the back we're gonna pass it under this left strand gold cord and then with the left we're gonna make it around and through the back and from the back through this loop here or a gap as you wish and now from the top into the loop on the right side we're gonna pull it secure it and proceed Now with the green one on top of the gold, around from the back, through the loop, Okay, I think this will be enough for our today's bracelet. Let us try. And it fits perfectly. Now we're gonna create the four strand parkour stop knot. So we're gonna tingle with these cords here. And we're gonna simply start. We're gonna take this green and make it on top of this gold one. Now we're gonna take this gold and make it around on top of the green. Now with this green we're gonna make it on top of the gold here. And with this gold we're gonna make it on top of the green and under this on top of the first green here and under this second green here. Like so. And we're gonna create some shape of a box. Now from here, we are gonna take the gold paracord, this first one, and we are gonna pass it next to this gold here, and from the side we are gonna enter this gap and through the middle here. So through this gap and to the middle. Now under the green from the gap and then through the middle and pull now we're gonna do the same with the green we're gonna pass this green here and we're gonna pass it through the gap here and through the middle so through the gap and through the middle Now we're gonna take this gold one here and we're gonna pass it next to this gold here as you can see through the gap between gold and the green 
and then through the middle or through this box shape here so around through the gap between gold and the green and then through the middle of the box shape and we're left with the last green so we're gonna pass it next to the this green here and then into the gap between green and the gold and through the middle of a box shape and we're gonna pull it secure it and proceed So here we are, as you can see our today's project is finished, I hope that you like it, if you do don't forget to leave a like, share this video with your friends and the family, and if you're not subscribed consider subscribing and hit the bell button so you'll be notified whenever we post a new video. So that being said, until the next time, wishing you just best, stay safe, be well, and I'll see you soon in the next video. Take care, see you soon, bye.